hi lovelies welcome back to the channel if it's your first time please like and subscribe to our channel to our returning subscribers thank you our vvips today we are prepping stew and let's do this to start with we are going to be bringing out our blocked off house from the goat meat and some goat meat allow this to defrost and wash neatly already i prepped prepped and pre-boiled my tomato and pepper mix and this is what we have so after washing the goat meat i added my curry maggi and lots of onion set this on fire to steam for some time to bring out the cook with its juice i'm steaming for it to cook with its juice so the spices can go in generously i stirred this for some time so it doesn't burn so once the juice started coming out, I closed it and allowed it to cook in it just for some minutes. This is amazing for you to try if you're always complaining that your meat does not get all the taste that you want it to get. Try this and thank me later. I added some more water to it to cook very soft because of course I'll be needing the juice to continue with my cooking. And then I'm frying this lightly because I'm going to be having my stew in the fridge for some time. So yeah, we know that um, goat's meat dissolves in soup when it's in the fridge for a long time. So to avoid that, I lightly fry this. But if you don't like fried meat, you can skip this part and do you. Thank you for always coming back to watch our videos, our recipes. And this is me trying to see if there's something on your mind you really want to do and it looks like you don't have all the way without to start and commence that stuff. Just try anyway. You don't know if you don't try. I've been procrastinating food content because I feel I don't have all that I need to have to start. But I just told myself, Shalom, you have yourself, you have your phone and you have your kitchen start from somewhere because what Rome wasn't built in a day at this point I was done frying my meat I packed it out still the oil on fire I started going in with my spices that's my maggi spice I added remember I would always say I love to season my oil it brings out more of the flavor for me you could try it and thank me later. I went in with some rosemary leaves, dry rosemary leaves, and then my kitchen was already buzzing with amazing aroma. I went in with some sliced onion, allowed that to fry for some time. I just like the smell that comes with fried onion and my spices. It just sends me to the mood. I loved it. And then I went in with my tomatoes you guys this tomato is so red probably because i added a lot of prepared peppers into it i don't know and then the tomato was fresh and red too so be sure the special of tomatoes you get it will give you a good tasting stew so you are not making stew in your house and still yearning for the stew outside yeah i said what i said and a quick note, ensure that you are very generous with your oil. That changes the taste of your stew. You don't get it. Like, it doesn't matter the oil you are using. Just shall be generous with the oil. And then come back and thank me. Like I would say, at this point, it had fried for some time. And because I had pre-cooked my tomatoes and the water had dried before, it didn't take time. I go in with my secret ingredients with a spice city. You guys, if you cannot access Spice City, use any good stew seasoning that you have. It will do something nice to your stew. Yes, I allow this to cook for some time. I went in with my meat stock and then you see what we got. The oil is coming together. You see, you see. See, there's enough oil on this stew, you guys. Oh my god, I did cook a pig. Like you guys, you need to bring your plate ASAP. At this point, I decided to go in with my proteins. I had some fish. I added that, some fish. I added that. And then you guys, this is cooking beautifully. 
You might want to ask why I'm adding my protein at this point. I still want it to swim in the juiciness of the stew. Can you not see? It's giving buka stew vibe. My God! I didn't add egg to this stew, boiled egg, because, like I said, I was packing them in the fridge and I wouldn't want the eggs to be blocked. This is what you got. Bring your plate. Let's eat. Ah, ah.